Aloha. Look at this java plum tree just dripping with fruits. <laughs> now, its scientific name is Cizichium communi, and you can find it growing in tropical and subtropical locations around the globe. This tree typically maxes out around 50 feet tall here in Hawaii, that's 15 meters, but it can be found growing up to 100 feet tall, that's 30 meters, in other locations around the globe. Now, you can find the tree growing in dry mesic forests, but it really, really, really loves riverbeds or riparian environments. Heavy fruit producers, their glossy, ovoid-shaped fruits start out green and then turn pink and then purple. And when fully ripe, they are a gorgeous black purple, similar kind of to a fat black olive. Java plum fruits are incredibly, powerfully nutritious, but they are mouth-puckeringly astringent as well. Now, java plums have a seed, and we can use the seed for herbal medicine, or compost them, or throw them in the trash, because this is a habitat-modifying invasive species, which means we do not want to spread the seed any further. Flowers are nectar-filled, funnel-shaped, with lots of tiny white thread-like stamens. And they smell like honey. <laughs> the leaves come off the stem in an opposite leaf pattern. Now, and they grow into these beautiful long leaves with a pronounced yellow midrib. The leaves are kind of thick and leathery, and when you crush them and smell them, oh, they smell so good. <laughs> Java plum leaves are available year round, so you might want to try harvesting a few, washing them, lightly crushing them with your hand, putting them into your water bottle, and enjoying some flavored water. The bark is also used for flavor and medicine. The upper bark being light gray and smooth, and the lower bark being dark gray and rough. Sacred to Buddhists, Hindus, and Jains, this tree is written about in their most ancient myths and legends. An aromatic treasure trove, java plum is truly medicine food. A little bit goes a very long ways. So we've harvested our aromatic treasure trove, and here today I wanted to tease into your imagination a few different ways that you can create delicious food out of the java plum. For starters, we have java plum fruit that's been made into jello. We have java plum that's been made into a, a tapenade and filled with parmesan into puffs. We have java plum chutney with cassava. We have java plum rum cake. We have java plum that have been made into almost like a natural li hing mui. And we have java plum mac nut spread. We have java plum fruit roll-ups. Oh my gosh, I know you want these recipes. So be sure and check out the Savage Kitchen app as well as our online wild food classes.